Hello everyone, today I'll be showing you everything new with the Wix rework. The new stuff includes an entire meter at the side in which you can plug in various light bulbs to make yourself stronger. These bulbs will only work once your meter is charged. They will also work as long as your meter is charged. The only way to lose charge is to either be starving or be super wet, so once you get an upgrade it's pretty much permanent. This isn't too important as you gain charge over time, however do keep this in mind as taking out any bulbs will drain your charge meter meaning you will need to wait until the meter charges if you want to switch upgrades. That is, unless you have a wicker bottom slave. These upgrades can be unlocked by scanning specific enemies with the bio scanalyzer. The hardy circuit can be unlocked by scanning a butterfly. Each of these bulbs gives you an additional 50 health, and filling your meter with them gives you a max health of 450. A stronger version of this can be unlocked by scanning the nurse spider. Each of these bulbs give you an extra 150 health, capping out at 600 health. That number is so big that you're basically wearing armor without wearing armor. You can literally stand underneath deer clops and tank 8 hits before the game crashes because the update isn't beta. The super processing circuit can be unlocked by scanning nightmare creatures. Equipping 3 of these makes your maximum sanity 425. To get the drone master circuit you have to scan bee queen and because doing that is extremely dangerous you should use a pan flute to put her to sleep. This upgrade will heal you slowly over time. If you have two of these equipped you can heal roughly 1 health every 8 seconds, which is pretty good. Scanning Crabkin gives you the Chorus Box Circuit, which turns you into a living music box that plays melodies. Anyone who stands near you gets a bit of sanity. You can now finally roleplay as Glomer and Don't Starve. Scanning Berger unlocks an upgrade that increases your hunger by 75. You can have a maximum of 375 hunger if you have 3 of these. Scanning Rabbits by trapping them and dropping them on the floor gives you one giant light bulb that takes up all the slots and makes you move faster. This is definitely the one people will be rushing since not only is speed incredibly overpowered in this game, but rabbits are one of the first things you find when spawning in. If you scan a rook and rook specifically, you can get a better upgrade that does the same job but takes less slots. Filling yourself with speed buffs makes you move at this speed. It kind of feels like I'm using console commands because that's how fast it is. Scanning dragonfly gives you a thermal circuit which heats you up preventing you from freezing. Anyone who stands near you will get this bonus as well, so that's cool. Scanning Deerclops gives you basically the same thing except it makes you colder. Scanning Vault Codes gives you the Electrification Circuit which deals a solid amount of damage to things that hit you. It's enough to kill a spider in 3 hits. Scanning Molrums gives you Night Vision and scanning those light bugs from the Lunar Grotto makes you a walking light bulb. And that's pretty much it for this rework. It's a game changing one for sure but it's also very well implemented. The scanning is not nearly as annoying as it sounds. There's this binary in Wix's compendium and translating it says, too late, too late, too late. So I'll leave you guys with that. There's also some like word changes but that doesn't affect anyone since no one plays word.